We miss the celebrations, the charge and hustle during homestands, the stadium surprises beforehand. One, two. This one cute right back up the middle. But Perhaps impacted the most uniquely by all the diamonds roughing it through COVID-19 are those who not only work at the ballpark, but play there Good ball. without ever swinging a bat. Meet seven-year-old Finn the Bat Dog of the AAA Las Vegas Aviators. Good boy. And six-month-old Turbo of the single-A Bowling Green Hot Rods, a rookie retriever slated to greet his fans this month. It's a start. Neither is taking the field because baseball on all levels is waiting on deck for health officials in each city to allow them to play ball. Hey, good job, gentlemen. This is earmarked to be Turbo's first season, that is, if the Kentucky club has one. They're already supplying merchandise in his own name and image, and his Twitter voice is supplied by marketing and social media manager Holly Hawkins. Oh, man, I really miss Turbo. <laughs> really, really was excited for everyone to meet him and just to get to walk around the ballpark with him and enjoy baseball and the dog. It's like, as long as I can go swimming every day and pick up my bat, I'm, I'm pretty happy. Trainer Fred Hassan calls his dog Finn a veteran bat retriever. The Black Lab has his own bobblehead, his own derpy doggy meme, his own style of hopping into work while balancing bat retrieval with some actual balancing on a fire hydrant in front of the kind of crowds Vegas celebs are familiar with. You think about the people that come to Las Vegas and play. All of the showrooms in Las Vegas are like Caesar's Palace, the big ones. They can hold about 5,500 people. But Finn's playing in front of 10,000 people for 70 nights a year. Eat your heart out, Wayne Newton. We are thrilled to have you here. You know, actually, a few years ago at Wayne Newton's uh, property, he actually gave us a call and was having some problems with his geese back there. <laughs> And we cleared all the geese out in a couple days. So, so Finn, Finn happens to know Wayne. Uh, great guy. <laughs> Where's your Las Vegas story for the day? But these days, the viruses mostly kept Finn and Turbo from their ballparks. They're training as opposed to helping players and entertaining fans. Turbo's progress on social media shows a pint-sized pup to diligent dog to bigger bat caddy to nearly ready to fetch in the field. And with a bit of luck, these empty stadiums will eventually be full again. Yeah, I think there's there's definitely hope. What do you think about that, Finn? You all right with that? Yeah, it looks like he is. I'm going to be honest. I'm probably going to end up crying. Just happiness of just being able to be in the ballpark again. Um, you know, share my love of baseball with everyone else. Um, for the dog, I, I hope he's really excited. He loves meeting new people, so I'm sure he'll be overjoyed with how many people want to meet him um, when we do get to play baseball.